All right, today we're gonna to talk about the 1D and the 1C cell flashlight by Meritac. Okay. And what are some of the advantages of having or owning one of these? I'm curious. So in an emergency situation, um, I don't know a lot of flashlights out there that will work on one cell, especially one D cell or one C cell. Uh, there's a lot of flashlights that work on a single AAA or a AA, but not on a uh, one D cell or a C cell. The advantages are these have high capacity uh, up in the in the D cell size. I think they range up to eight to ten thousand milliamps, which is a lot of wow. runtime on a one and a half volt battery. Um, so in an emergency, you might only have one ba a battery. Uh, lots of flashlights take multiple batteries, but you might have only one good battery. So the advantages are they're extremely bright. There's a low and there's the high and uh, up to 500 lumens in the high mode. Um, and emergency caches uh, in situations where the county or uh, a state agency or federal agency, no? Oh, no, no, oh, yes, yeah. Yeah, so um, they would probably have a lot of D cells, a lot of C cells, yep. a lot of double A's. A lot of triple A. So this gets you, you know, the ability to kind of roll with whatever they've got. Hey, what are you going to give me? You're going to give me a D cell? Fine, I'll take a D cell. Yeah, one D cell can run for a long, long time, and here it is. So um, the cool thing about them, they come, it doesn't come with a battery. Here I'm using a common known battery, and this is a, probably about 8,000 milliamps. And it's an O-ring seal, has a tripod mount on the oh, bottom, so you can okay. mount a standard tripod. Uh, camera tripod, so uh, handy for as a task light. And the cool thing about it is, hey, I want to. I got some double A's. Okay. This comes with it, not without the battery, without but the battery, with a battery yes. tray. So you put your own double A's in there. You put your D cell aside, and now you can run four double A's. It could be rechargeable double A's. Could be lithium. Just all the same type, whatever type they are. Yeah, they get and there's the a lot, and the high is even higher. So let's shoot wow. up onto the wall here. So there it is on high, and there it is on low. This is all machined aluminum with an aluminum reflector with a slight okay. orange peel. I think one of the advantages, though, is if you put the, you know, you load up your D cell or whatever you've got in it, you put it on your coffee table in your dark house. And it lights up the entire room oh, because absolutely. it's got a flat tail tail on it. Yep, it will just it sits there. Yep, and it will light the whole entire room. Yep, a long long time. There's some holes in here for a lanyard if you want to have a lanyard on there. It's a perfect walking light. If you if you back the switch off, this is just a rotating switch from high to low, and that's the on and off also. So there's a simple user interface. The nice thing about it is, and the way I use mine is when I'm out walking, I have a lanyard on my wrist. I have, I back this I have this the light on I back it off just a little bit and then I just push this for high and low I just push the back of the cap mm. it becomes like a switch and it works flawlessly so there it is in the wall and there it is with double A's so again the advantage is I can go to this insert which comes with it for four double A's and switch right back to a D cell and get a lot of wrong time out of this and I don't know any other flashlights that have one I think the Navy had some little uh, 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 life uh, lifeboat markers right. that were you life know, jacket yeah, markers. and they were incandescent but that was the take on this that could still run on a single uh, battery and this is, is and this is the exact same thing except runs uh, on C cell on a C cell and of course this one has triple A's in it but it'll run on one C cell so which okay. is very cool so there's the size difference in my hand Again, they both have the tripod, tripod, tripod mount okay. on there. They're aggressively knurled, so they won't slip out of your hand. And uh, I think it's a good addition to any emergency, uh, yeah. your kit or household or have it in your uh, car. I was talking to a client the other day that uh, has the D cell, and uh, his work uses D cells. And when the batteries start getting weak. They toss, you know, there's oh. five of them in a flashlight. They throw those away. He probably gets a lot of use out of them. He recovers those, and he says, you know, he's... Getting you know, hours of still light still It out. sounds like he's got way too many batteries now. Yeah. But, you know, so one battery goes a long, long way. It is glass, anti-reflective glass. Um, 
a very clear glass with again this has an orange peel uh, reflector on it so it makes a nice smooth beam there's the low there's the high and uh impressive light i mean uh brought this back up again because we're getting into that season right now where uh the seasons will start changing here in the fall and it gets dark earlier and uh who knows what's coming down the road uh especially mm -hmm. you know with our whole uh situation with um the viruses and things like that who knows batteries might be hard to get don't know anyway thanks for watching there it is the 1c and 1d meritac flashlight that takes double a's or triple a's or 1c and 1d battery okay but now you just have to say the hey if you really enjoyed this video if you enjoyed this video like and subscribe <laughs> there you go and if you don't like the video don't say nothing i was gonna say like and subscribe <laughs> okay, okay bye bye